Uh, joined by Matty Bloor and Terry Barwick after Gaul AFC's 3-0 uh, win over Hall Road Rangers in the extra preliminary round of the FA Cup. Uh, lads, first, uh, firstly, congratulations. Good win. Um, that's nine goals scored this season and none conceded. You must be pleased with that. Definitely. Um, it's, another, um, it's another personal achievement for, for me and, and Terry and another um, achievement that we set out before the season and we wanted to win the first FA Cup game for, for eight years. Um, and, we, and we said today, to be fair, it was, you know, league positions and uh, what league they're in, it all goes out, out, the, uh, out the window on, on FA Cup day. And, uh, and to be fair, we said before the game, this would be equally as tough as any other game this season. Um, I think they tried to sort of, um, not drag us down, but you know, we got dragged into a little bit of, uh, of their style of football. Although granted at times they did, they did try to pass out from the back to be fair. Um, and we got a little bit frustrated at times first half, but I think ultimately, I think those who, who came could see our quality at times came through, particularly in the uh, in, in our own fair defensively and, and was going forward. I thought we looked dangerous when we went forward. And then and you look at the score and it says it again, you know, nothing conceded and three goals scored. So, you know, take out the the bits of the performance we think we know we can work on. Um, first and foremost today, I think, you know, we've got the result we wanted and we're, and we're over the moon. So just an, another question uh, sort of directly at you, Matty. You just mentioned there about uh, things that you can work on. Is there is there things that jump out at you from that? From that, uh, from a fan's point of view, as I say, we've scored nine, conceded none. Everyone's happy off the pitch. Absolutely, yeah. But, you know... Anybody, footballer or team or managers, you can always get better. Um, and it's important to look at the positives. There's always, always negatives, no matter how many you win by. Um, I think we got frustrated easily. I think that you know it was windy, it was blowing a gale. It was easy to get frustrated. A lot of overhit passes that otherwise um, would have been good quality balls. And and, and this pitch, you know, it's it's not the um, it's not the most level. It's very very narrow. So for me personally, as a midfielder, it's hard to transfer the ball uh, from side to side and, and, and long diags, but. I thought we rode that storm a little bit, but um, we'll keep keep those things we need to work on close to our chest. We know exactly what we need to work on, and and uh, and, and we'll do that in training on, on Tuesday night. Yeah, very good, very good. Behind closed doors, yeah. good effort. So um, obviously, Terry, uh, Matty's just mentioned the wind there. Uh, I think people who watch the highlights, people who are here today, uh, will probably see that the wind had quite a big effect on the game. First half, with the wind at our backs, a lot of balls perhaps going a bit too long, and then second half actually scored two into the wind. Uh, quite pleased with that. Very pleased to be honest. I mean, the first half everybody expects, oh, you've got the wind, you're going to be, you're going to be, you need to get in front, this, that, the other. I always felt the second half with our front three would create problems when the ball's holding up with, with the pace. So, uh, listen, it, it, it's a tough one. It's a tough day at the office, really, for everybody. I, I said to the boys, you know, by hook or by crook, we need to be in that next round. And, and at the end of the day, it's a, it's a good, good, solid professional performance. Clean sheet and three more goals. Um, job done, really. Absolutely, and um, certainly not goal shy so far this season. So the, the strikers, plenty of confidence. Yeah, hundred percent. The lads, you know, there's, there's a lot of confidence in the group already. And, and as young lads, they're only going to get more confident, and, and you know, and, and learning, and, and hopefully, you know, long may it continue. Yeah, yeah. Are we, are we uh, at this stage? I say we as Gaul fans, as, as people connected with Gaul AFC. Are we uh, trying to sort of limit um, the expectations? Are we still sort of trying to play it cool a little bit? I mean, it's two good results, but it's still very early. Two good results, but it's, it's two games. You know, it was a, it was a cup game today. It was a freebie, if you like, in terms of the, obviously in terms of the league. Um, but we've got to we've got to all keep us feet. But you know, Tez, Tez said in there to lads, he thinks that we played at 60, 70 percent today. Um, and you know I can't really disagree with that. Um, there's, there's so much more to come from this group of players, um, but we've, we've got to keep believing. We've got to keep learning. We've got to get fitter, and we've got to get um, you know more togetherness. We've got to keep we've got to keep everybody fit as well. You know this level of football is another what, three three missing today. You know it, it's hard, but the thing difference this year to last year is I think we've got a, a, a squad of players. You know even obviously I have to chuck myself on today, and, and um, it's not ideal, but you know that's what we have got this year. We've got a squad. Um, and it's important we keep everybody try and keep everybody as happy as we can. But there's some good lads in there, some good lads as, as people, and, and, and that's first and foremost, good people. But some good, really good footballers. I will only get better and better with, with the right coaching, which hopefully we'll give them. 
with the right preparation and, and, and the right amount of game time. And, and we think that we're, we're the guys to, to bring them on and, uh, and hopefully long may it continue. Absolutely. And um, so Fackley, I believe, away next game, uh, next Saturday. Um, what are your thoughts looking ahead to that fixture? It's still too early to, to sort of look too far ahead. Obviously, uh, obviously we're, we're, Friday night. <laughs> listen, we're, we're, we're already looking forward to, to fixtures, but we'll, we'll enjoy tonight. It's the wife, it's the wife. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, you know, five, 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 five. That's getting cut yeah. out. That's getting cut out. Sack that off. Sorry, boys. That's all unprofessional. Right, no, no, I think that's funny, that. I, I, <laughs> you've got to put that on. You've got to put that on. <laughs> oh, jeez. Right. What will we say? And what will we right. That clean. That clean. That will be you know, another tough test. They're, they're, they're a good football inside. Uh, got a lot of pace about the team, but. Like I said, we're going to look at a zone house all the time now and, and get the lads prepared, ready. Yep. Okay, good effort. Well, lads, good effort today. Well done. Cheers, Good effort. Thank you. And uh, well done. Congratulations. Cheers. Cheers.